the point which I told in Gauchas disease type 1 it shows very good improvement type 2 and 3 it uh, it is given only for palliation enzyme replacement therapy in type 2 and 3 does not improve neurological features Question number two says which of the following diseases have enzyme replacement therapy ERT as an option for treatment. We have four options here. Gauchas disease, Pompe disease, Fabry disease and Hurler disease and then we have combinations here. Option, say, option A says only 1, 2 and 3 is correct. Option B says 1 and 2 is correct. Option C says only 3 and 4 is correct. Option D says all are correct. The answer to this is all are correct because enzyme replacement therapy for all these four diseases are now available according to Nelson. So what does Nelson say? Again, very important point. Nelson says ERT is available for the following inborn errors of metabolism. Firstly, it is available for Gaucher's disease. In fact, Gaucher's disease was the first inborn error of metabolism for which enzyme replacement was available. So they can ask you. It's an old neat PG question, but super speciality they can, you know, end of the day they can still ask you which was the first inborn error of metabolism in which enzyme replacement was available the answer was Gauchas disease then we have Pompe's disease or also called as glycogen storage disease type 2 we have Fabry's disease we have mucopolysaccharidosis but not for all forms it is available for type 1 that is Hurler syndrome it is available for type 2 that is Hunter syndrome it is available for type 4 that is Morphure syndrome and type 6 that is Moretio-Lamy disease so very very important point and before you forget the point which I told in Gauchas disease, type 1, it shows very good improvement. Type 2 and 3, it, uh, it is given only for palliation. Enzyme replacement therapy in type 2 and 3 does not improve neurological features. Please add this point prominently in your revision file before the exam. Subscribe and press the bell icon so you never miss an update from PrepLadder.